SMP SMP server season three. So I'm going to. Oh. Hey, Chad. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to quickly run through the lore and rules for you all to see, and then I have a bed and light. So I'm on the light side or whatever. So. <coughs> There was no doubt that the fallout of the time many years ago left scars on the land. But resulting later stories no longer have predicted. Though the land that was seasoned to survive for a short period of time in that post fallout world it couldn't survive forever. Couldn't survive forever. And it didn't. Eventually the world began to fall apart. Entire sections of the planet, follies of void, entire biome, bolimes, cities, many lives were lost. Those who survived fled to this last safe zone they knew. HC. Which I think is the castle. HC castle. We're not even this way. around the castle continued to crumble and void each closer and closer to it. Soon it seemed the castle was the only thing left to exist. However, a strange force seemed to keep the castle standing. Those who survived to reach the castle were shot. After the entire world disappeared, what remains was castle in the sky. And at the same time, the world passed closer. Two worlds opened up. One dark, one night. Someone named Louis and came back to the Lukubu, a new world had been born. The world that allowed an escape from this one. An escape from what little was left. The origin of the force made those portals is unknown. But for the sake of those who did live through these dreams, the only reason they still have their lives. This world has found a new balance and lasts in perfect, in the perfect state of the dark for now. However, after two worlds prior have been lost and memories stolen with them, the people who live in this new world can feel safe then and never forget the past. Okay, alright, let's move into the rules. Okay, like, you can grab between worlds, however, you must live in world more. Science 2. You are allowed to build things in the other world, but houses and non-swan shops must be done in your home world. Oh, cool, your shop is awesome. Server builds, there are many pre-built structures and dungeons in both worlds. You have to build, you cannot be boxed in the build or sheet build in any way. Shop spawn shop has currency of buying and However, player shops must be made with paintings and building in the world box. If you want to play your shop at the spawn, check out the spawn shop info area. Creeping, you're not going to be paying attention to what you want to do. You may have a great block of the homeless homeless shop in the site for cranking, and you may have a great block of the server. Good deal. Parents are not allowed to be full players or break blocks with another player to build. Any else is free as long as it is your bad. Zero death players. You may not kill as zero death player unless you attack you first. Even if you encourage you, they are safe. You may kill them however you favor you should do. Houses. Clear houses can be built anywhere as long as you are or in the <coughs> or not. Only close to you or on the server build or come close to you or on someone else's house or build. You must live in the world assigned to you. PvP is allowed only two circumstances can be built people or on purge day. Okay, not purge day. On certain days, you must be made through the purge. You may kill anyone and whatever ends up on purge day. Or raiding hostility is not allowed. You have to finish your ability dungeons with prizes to make table items slide only. It's not redo until back at a later date. Standard prize. Hostility will be talked to members of the community. I'll play new. Retain. I'm late. 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 I'm I can do common sense. Alright, let's find this, uh, light portal to begin my journey. I don't know where those are. I'm guessing... Okay. So... These are the shops. Got it. Okay. Oh, this is really cool. Assigned the light side. So, light side for the win! Alright. Lots of lag there. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh my goodness. I think we're gonna have a lot of fun here. This is the first SMP that I've ever been a part of. Oh wow. Hello, Paul. Whoa. This is. That's really cool. That's real cool. All right. So, <clears throat> okay. So, no, that's the wrong button. <sighs> As a member of the light team, I vow to be super nice and all that. I'm gonna make a house. I think the first order of business here is to find a good place for a house. So I'm just gonna kind of go wandering, and what I'll probably do is I'll cut to. Where, um, I'm going to, uh, what's it called? Ah, my brain's not working. I'm going to cut to, uh, where I'm building my house.
I think one more tree, and then we'll find a place to nestle ourselves. That's a ravine. Oh my gosh. There's a ravine right there. Okay. I'm gonna take a piece of wood. I'm gonna make myself a wooden axe. I'm gonna get, like, basic, um, stuff. And, uh, so... Basically, I'd like to set up, set down some goals for the series. One goal is to die um, as the least amount as possible. Like, if we can keep it to five deaths um, max, that'd be great. Let me just, just need to pick up some dirt, maybe get like a little bridge over this ravine. So that's my goal number one. Goal number one... Uh, not not uh, undeath like minimal death that's goal number 1 goal number 2 is to um have a real swanky house once i get a swanky house that kind of like cements myself into the um server as someone who knows what they're doing i want to be someone who knows what they're doing, even though I'm not. <laughs> so, um... I'm just gonna... Let's get some... Pickaxe here. And... Sword. Just in case. Right. I'll just mine this, I guess. Okay. So, let's see if I can get... Ooh, 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 ah, Okay. Okay, ooh, ah, okay. So, I'm gonna get some stone for a, um, pickaxe. Okay, so this is like a bunch of andesite here. I wouldn't mind a little uh, andesite because then you can polish it. Then it looks kind of good. We can make it part of our house. But what I'm really here for is the stone at the moment so I can kind of get started. And we're doing good. Only 12 minutes so far. I have a limit to 30 minutes. So um, I'm going to do two episodes, one right after the other gonna just do a bit a lot of mining here get everything all nice okay so I think that's enough stone for right now so also I'm gonna try to get these pathways a little more accessible good all right so mm, low on food there's a chicken over there if I can just uh, I'm pretty sure swords any sword one hit kills a chicken so Ooh, wolf really like a wolf but I don't have any bones and since this place is Perma day. I don't think I'll be finding any skeletons soon. But, um, I can try. Maybe if there's a skeleton down in the, um, what's it called? Uh, ravine. It'll be easier to take. So I'm just gonna eat some Raya chicken. Like that. Sounds good. Sounds nice. So, I'm just gonna... So... Oh no, I needed to upgrade my uh, tools. Right, right, right. That's why I grabbed all that um, stone. What am, I, what am I doing? I don't know. Um, let's see. Let's get... Uh, Need a little more wood. 
so. A few more sticks. Let's get there. Perfect. I don't know if you can do with diorite. No, you can't. So, okay. So, we've got this stone pick right there. And... Mm, I think I'll make a furnace later. I don't think we need a furnace right now. Um... Yeah, so, okay, I think I'm going to have to cut it off here. So this has been the first episode of my playthrough of the Hazard Craft SMP server here, um, Season 3. And in the next episode, we'll be exploring this ravine. And until then, I will see you later. Bye! Go light side! <laughs>